I'm Scott Cousins, editor of the Frankfurt Times, and these are some of the stories you will see in Tuesday's paper. Following the tragic death of 15-year-old Adrian Alanis, Frankfurt officials are implementing new safety measures at the TPA pool. Jacob Slauson was having a good time Sunday at Optimistic Day, an annual event for mentally and physically handicapped children and adults held at the Clinton County Fairgrounds. He was not the only one. Organizer Lou Whitaker said about 400 special needs participants, plus their caregivers and family, came out. Participants came from as far away as Indianapolis and Kokomo. Due to budget woes over the past several years, the United Way of Clinton County will relocate and has sold its building at their current location. Most Clinton County school districts saw a drop in performance on the 2014 ISTEP Plus test, with two school districts performing below statewide average, according to data released Monday by the Indiana Department of Education. And finally, law enforcement agencies all across the country will come together Tuesday evening to promote crime prevention awareness, and Clinton County and Frankfurt will be no exception. For more, buy a copy of the Frankfurt Times or visit ftimes.com. Again, I'm Scott Cousins, and thank you.